Today is Saturday, February the 8th. Good afternoon and welcome to Saturday Super Sports. Up next, we have golf for you, one of two uh, golfing programs for you, the AT&T Pebble Beach uh, Golf Tournament that was played at Pebble Beach National. That's next. And then for a change, we have uh, darts for you this afternoon, the Embassy World Darts Championships just before 25 past 3. And then more golf for you, N Palmer's great performance recently in the Johnny Walker Asian Classic where he picked up his biggest paycheck ever. And following that, at uh, around about 20 to 5, we'll be meeting the South African cricket teams that play against Western Australia. Well, 11 of the 14 will be tomorrow, the entire South African squad in Australia. Our football preview and uh, John Fashion who previews all the matches today in the English First Division. Our live match this afternoon is an all-important one for the Reds as Liverpool travel to Coventry to play against Coventry City. And analysing that and also looking at the league situation, who needs to do what to try and catch Manchester United if they are going to Terry Payne and uh, Gary Bailey, the lads, this afternoon. And uh, just a result, if you missed it this morning, our boxing from Atlantic City and uh, a good win there for Doug DeWitt over, or draw rather, for Doug DeWitt over Tyrone Frazier making his comeback. Jimmy Paul upset Todd Foster in his comeback fight, the former world champion. But this is the big upset of the year so far. Larry Holmes beat Ray Mercer, the former WBO champion today, over 12 rounds. He outpointed him in a non-title fight. That was a result that has really shaken the world there. Good afternoon. Welcome from Darren Scott for Saturday Super Sport this afternoon. Coming up in a moment, the first of two golf programs for you today. And it's the AT&T Pebble Beach Classic. We'll be having a look at that in just a moment. Stay with us. Tell us who will rule the world and one lucky person can win nine autograph bats from the teams competing in the Benson and Hedges World Cup. Entry forms in the sports pages of the Sunday Times and Report, February 9th and 16th, and the March Mnet TV Guide. Fifteen lucky runners-up can win a fantastic cricket kit worth 3,000 rand each. Don't miss the biggest, most exciting cricket event in the world. Starting 22nd February, the Benson and Hedges World Cup. Only on Mnet Supersport, your channel of champions. And we have got quite a bit of golf for you this afternoon, a little later on, in fact, just before four o'clock, it's Ian Palmer's great performance at the Johnny Walker Asian Classic. Don't miss that one. First of all, though, it's time to go to the three courses at Pebble Beach in California for what turned out to be another great week for Marco Miera. Only one man stood in his way from picking up his fifth tournament victory there, and that man, Jeff Sluman. It's the Pebble Beach, uh, AT&T Pebble Beach National Tournament that was played there. We're going to pick up the action on the 16th with uh, Sluman two shots ahead of Miera. We're going to look at Amira now playing his second shot on the 16. Let's see what happened there as they head maybe for a playoff. Then this is Pat Summerall saying so long from the Pebble Beach Golf Links in Pebble Beach, California. Great performance there by Mark Amira playing on what you could call his home course. And uh, Ian Palmer in Thailand, that's coming up at around about 5 to 4. Some cricket updates for you and the match at Springbok Park at Tea Time, Free State. 375 all out. Franklin Stevenson got 100 today as well. In reply, Northern Transvaal at T92 for two. Vernon Dupree there with 44 not out. At St. George's Park, Western Province resuming at 216 for six. 263 all out at T at the moment. Eastern Province 90 for three. Louis Quinn there with 40. And at Buffalo Park, Transvaal declared this morning at 405 for five declared at the moment. Border at T time are 44 for two. More scores coming up here later on. Coming up in a few moments' time, it starts. Hier is een wenk voor die Agus Pick and Pay Fiets Tour. Oefen maar vroegtijdig en degelijk voor die jaarse wedren. Three twenty-five. It's a game that we all here play, but not often see on Supersport. It's the Embassy World Professional Darts Championships played at Frimley Green. The final between Phil Taylor and Mike Gregory. The game is 5-0-1 and your commentators are Tony Green and Sid Waddell. <laughs> 